Fernando Cuadrado S. Inertia Uruguay. The front of our eye is covered by a transparent membrane, the cornea. The sclera is the white outer covering. Movement of the eye is controlled by small muscles attached to it. Light passes into the eye through an opening called the pupil. The iris surrounds the pupil, opening or closing in degrees to control the amount of light the eye receives. Light passes through the lens and onto the retina in the back of the eye. The choroid attaches to the back of the retina and provides it with support and blood for nourishment. Light-sensitive cells in the retina produce electrical signals that travel along the optic nerve to the brain. When we look at an object, rays of light coming from the object enter our eye and pass through the lens. The lens bends the light so that rays originating from any one point on the object converge to a single point on the retina. Rays leaving the top of the object end up at the bottom of the retina, producing an inverted image. To focus on nearby objects, the lens must change its shape. It thickens, causing light rays from the object to converge on the retina. To see objects far away, tiny muscles flatten the lens, thereby bringing the image into focus.